Do you think we are in VO3? If you cannot tell, does it matter? VO3 is here, and let me tell you, it's absolutely insane. Just when we thought VO2 had pushed the limits of what's possible in video generation, VO3 comes crashing through those limits with a storm of new features that feel straight out of a science fiction movie. Today, we're going to break down exactly what makes VO3 so different from its predecessor and why everyone is calling it the most powerful video model in existence. Now, let's be honest. VO2 was already impressive. It could generate realistic video from text, follow creative instructions, and even produce cinematic footage that felt like it was directed by a human. But with VO3, the game has changed entirely. Imagine being able to type a sentence like, a drone flies over a futuristic city at sunset, and within seconds, see a video that looks like it came out of a Hollywood studio. That's not exaggeration. That's the new standard. First, let's talk about realism and fidelity, because this is where VO3 blows everything else out of the water. VO2 was good, no doubt. But VO3 takes realism to another level. We're talking about 1080p video quality at a level of detail that feels photographic. The lighting is accurate. The shadows are natural. Motion is smooth, not jittery or robotic like older AI models. In fact, unless someone told you it was AI generated, you'd have no clue. People are already comparing some of VO3's clips to scenes straight out of National Geographic or a Christopher Nolan movie. But it's not just about how it looks, it's about how it listens. That's right. One of the most exciting additions in VO3 is audio generation. VO2 didn't have this. It was all silent video. You had to add your own sound afterward. VO3 changes that. It doesn't just generate video. It creates sound that matches the visuals. So if you generate a video of a rainforest, you don't just see the trees. You hear the birds chirping, the leaves rustling, and even the distant sound of water trickling. It's immersive in a way we've never experienced from a generative model before. And the sound isn't generic. It adapts to the scene, to the environment, and even to the action happening in the video. Let's move on to something creators are raving about. Prompt adherence and creative control. If you used VO2, you probably noticed it sometimes wandered off script. You'd ask for something specific, and it would do most of it, but at its own twist, often not what you wanted. That's no longer an issue. VO3 is shockingly obedient. You describe a scene, and it follows your prompt to the letter. This level of prompt adherence is not just fun, it's incredibly useful. It means directors, marketers, artists, educators, anyone, can rely on the model to bring their vision to life, not the model's best guess. But here's where it gets even more insane. VO3 doesn't just follow your commands. It gives you control at a granular level. You can adjust motion, camera angles, pacing, even the mood. You can tweak a generated scene to be faster, slower, darker, brighter. This isn't just typing a sentence and hoping for the best. It's like having a digital assistant director who listens to every command and immediately applies it. The creative control VO3 offers is almost like directing in real time. Want to change the lighting? Done. Want the camera to pull back instead of zoom in? Easy. Want the character to turn their head a second later? No problem. This level of creative precision was unthinkable just a few years ago. Now, it's real, and it's in VO3. Another major innovation is VO3's integration with Flow. Now, Flow is Google's new workspace for multimodal creativity, where you can blend text, images, audio, and video in one seamless interface. With VO3 built into Flow, you're no longer bouncing between apps. Everything happens in one place. You can start with a text description, generate a video, tweak the audio, overlay narration, and refine the visuals, all without leaving the Flow workspace. This tight integration supercharges productivity. It means creators can iterate faster, experiment more, and publish quicker. And here's the kicker. Because it's all connected, your video generation becomes part of a broader creative process, not a separate step. Need to align your video with a script written in ChatGPT? It's already there. Need to pull visuals from a doll e-scene? It's one click away. 
The future of content creation isn't fragmented, it's unified. And VO3 Plus Flow shows us exactly what that looks like. And here's something else. VO3 is surprisingly good at understanding context. If you generate a sequence of scenes, it doesn't just treat them as isolated clips. It understands continuity. So if your first scene shows a character entering a room, and the next prompt says they walk to the window, VO3 remembers the room layout, the lighting, and even the character's appearance. This is what makes it feel like real storytelling, not just disconnected visuals. Continuity used to be a huge problem with generative video. Not anymore. VO3 solves it with fluid transitions and narrative awareness. We've talked about visuals. We've talked about sound. We've talked about control, integration, and context. But here's what truly makes VO3 insane. It feels alive. The videos it generates aren't just technically accurate. They feel emotionally resonant. A quiet snowy street at dawn feels quiet. A bustling city market feels chaotic. A lonely figure walking through a forest feels melancholic. VO3 isn't just showing us images and sounds. It's capturing mood. That's something no AI video model has ever truly done. Until now. And this is just the beginning. What we're seeing with VO3 is a glimpse of where generative video is headed. Soon, we'll see even more advanced scene editing, better interaction with characters, and deeper narrative logic. But even today, VO3 is ahead of the curve. It's not just better than VO2. It's operating in a different league altogether. It doesn't just upgrade the technology. It changes the expectations. Once you see what VO3 can do, going back to anything else feels like stepping into the past. So yes, VO3 is insane. Not in a hype kind of way, but in a how is this even possible kind of way. It's smarter. It's sharper. It's more creative. It gives you tools you never thought you needed, and once you use them, you can't imagine working without them. From photorealistic detail to prompt perfect results, from audio sync to seamless flow integration, VO3 is the AI video model we've been waiting for. And if this is what VO3 can do now, just imagine what's coming next. If you have any questions or want me to try any specific prompt, write it down in the comments section. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video, then watch the next AI-related video that will appear in front of you soon.